Alrighty, welcome into another Squad Ops One Life event. Today we have Operation Sleeping Serpents Part Two, uh, a continuation of the, I guess you call it a mini campaign, what we had last week. In Russia again a little bit of a different uh, scenario this time this time the scenario is considerably more dangerous is I mean it's it's intentionally ridiculous not uh, intentionally ridiculous is the wrong way to say that why does my map okay cool Just, I need to go back and rebind everything again good to know Actually, speaking of rebinding, holy crap. How many times have we had to download patches for this release? Okay, to its credit, I didn't have to rebind buttons. It actually remembered I unbound all my SL buttons. Okay, cool. Uh, we've got the uh, operation map here. So the gist is Russia are going to push their advantage, supposed advantage, uh, in the situation by attacking a bridge and crossing it and trying to establish a foothold on the east side of the river here. Uh, the idea is that British will have a set amount of minutes to defend the bridge, whichever one Russia decides. They will have 10 minutes um, to establish base defenses course they'll it'll basically i mean uh it's not quite a uh i guess what do you call it a standing start uh a lamar start where both teams are at a uh their start position or their base and then they have to you know you know lamans where you start outside your car you have to get in your car and then or, yeah. you guys know what I mean, right? Anyway, uh, British will be starting at their main. They get 10 minutes to build their defensive position, which includes a tow, which includes fortifications, and includes barricading up the bridge itself, the bridge that uh, Russia are trying to cross. They'll know which bridge in advance that is. And uh, Russia yeah, will have to cross that bridge. Um... Russia will end up, I mean, I don't know. Has this operation ever worked out for Russia before? I think it's been close, but it's kind of a big hill. To, it's kind of a big hill to climb. All things considered, it is, uh, it's a big deal. Russia still planning out their attack here. But the uh, the idea of the map is that not everyone has to cross at the same time, right? So the uh, infantry obviously don't have to use the bridge to cross. All wheeled vehicles, however, must use the bridge to cross. That's the distinction as far as how things are gonna go. Uh, Russia, as far as vehicles, they have a BMP-2, a B two BTR-80s and two Tiger OT cords. Uh, Platoon-wise, they have two mini machine guns, two armor barrels, two armor barrels, four engineers and crewmen is needed for vehicles. And Russian squads are one SL, two FTLs, two ARs, one lat, one medic. They have two smoke mortars, and they also got a logi truck, which is cool. Wait. Oh, they're, oh, this is an old school rule. I haven't seen this in a while. We're using the platoon mortar setup. So the Logitruck truck is tied to the platoon mortar. 
they're only allowed to use the smoke rounds out of those mortars. So they get two mortars for smoke. Hmm. If you have really good people that know what they're doing with the mortar, I think that's pretty strong. Can't cut off the mortar. Anyway, uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, take a look, see, listen in on the brief here from Alpha Guido. See what he's see what right, plan well, he's got to crack the uh, the British egg here. All right, guys, welcome. So, British forces have secured the east side of the Gordok River Valley. Our job is to push across the northernmost bridge of the valley to gain a foothold for further attacks into the British territory. For this, we have been allocated quite a few heavy assets, including two BTRs, a BMP2, and two smaller uh, Tiger. Uh, MRAP vehicles. So, for this attack, we will be heading out of Maine, driving down the roads, eventually around the helmet marker, we will diverge from the road and take the tra the railroad. From there, we'll head along the railroad till we hit roughly the India, or till the lead vehicle hits the India Juliet line on that fading uh, Lodgy marker. From there, all elements will begin dismounting and begin spreading out. Silas will keep his BTRs back for approximately one minute after dismounting to give time for us to try to spot a tow on the immediate hill. Gonna mark that with a fob uh, with a fob marker. Hold on. So we're expecting most enemy contact to be centered around that fob mark there. So we'll be scouting that out for a possible tow position within a minute. After the minute, regardless of whether or not we found the tow position or not, Silas will then move his vehicles up and begin uh, unloading fire onto anyone they see. While that's going on, Decrum and Noss's squads, our two primary assault elements, will be staging up on the north side of the, uh, hold up. We'll be staging up around that Lodgy marker there, closer to the river. And we'll be waiting for the go-ahead to cross. That includes BMP-2, which we are going to be keeping back, since it is the only vehicle that can cross the river without the use of the bridge. While that is going on, Fulcrum's squad will begin uh, digging up a mortar battery for us to use for smoke cover. Located on the mortar mark. Any of his guys not directly uh, working on that mortar will begin. Will then move to the ridge line with the helmet mark and begin laying down suppressing fire on anything they see. Uh, while this is going on, uh, Paladin will be heading south to the helicopter mark and will begin also getting fire out uh, on to that uh, position uh, east of the river. Once uh, once we get a good amount of fire superiority, we'll give it most five minutes, but anything can happen, so that's a very, very tentative soft time. We will then send the assault elements of Decrum and Noss across. Decrum on the north side, Noss on the, so Noss on the south side. And they will begin pushing across using the BMP-2 as support. And begin sweeping that hill. A little bit after their assault begins, and they've secured a decent amount of that hill, then we will then send Paladin's guys across the river from where he is at. And we'll begin, uh, and we'll secure the east side of the bridge, and then begin helping out with the assault. Once we've secured the east side of the uh, bridge, and the other the three squads are continuing their assault, Fulcrum's guys will then begin clearing the bridge itself of any mines and obstacles that uh, are in the way. Once the mines and obstacles are down on the bridge, as well as once any mines east of the bridge are down and we can clear and confirm a safe route for the uh, vehicles, Silas will then bring his BTR and whatnot across the river. If we have not found the uh, British FOB already, we will then consolidate roughly around that hill, roughly around that fading FOB mark, uh, and then go and search for the British FOB location. Any questions? All right, SLs, pick them out, get ready for life. All right, so let's load our guys up. Noss, remember, you're running your entire... That's going to be a little bit of a ping-pong action. More action north, more action south, more action north, more action south, until uh, British are properly combob discombobulated, and then Russia just steamroll the bridge. So, you know... And then Silas, any guys you have dismounted... Kind of what uh, we were expecting... This northern terrain. Yeah, I won't really have 
have anybody dismounted. Um, unless you can just cram people in. I mean, that's all. That's all well and good over here. Um, my thinking, and if I'm misremembering, so be it. But this is a huge hill, and this there's a significant drop off here. There's almost like a sheer cliff edge here. Although you probably could climb this. I think everyone's good. All right. Yeah, we're in the second BTR. Uh, oh yeah, there is a little bit of a. Uh, you could definitely climb it though. Yeah, I guess it's not so much of a uh, a sheer cliff as I thought it was. I mean, there there is this little bit right here, but closer to the bridge, it is very uh, is very slopey. And of course, this is the bridge in question. North, the North Bridge on uh, Gordok is long. I don't know, as long as strong as down to get the friction on. I don't know why I came up with that. I need better things to say. <laughs> uh, let's see, where's the dismount point? Dismount point is around here. Uh, it's not going to be entirely safe. Shoot up, and we need to immediately send it another squad. Fulcrum, your squad will be the one going in. Oh, the railway. Uh, maybe if this is this, if this is the dismount point for infantry, yeah, this will be fine. The mortars will get high ground. They should get a few extra meters out of their range, but not that it will really matter. They can't use the actual mortar. They can only use the smoke rounds out of the mortar. Obvious defensive points for British forces include uh, everywhere on screen. This hill is going to be kind of a uh, key position. I imagine we'd see the toe. If we're going to see the toe, we're going to see it on this northern hillside. Either actually up in the up on the top here, which would give a which would give it the uh, the best chance to get a kill. On a vehicle, uh, given the the vehicles are gonna take this main road, this is generally the same uh, longitude line that uh, the, radius, the, red the infantry are gonna dismount. I want us to, clear, uh, to start. So probably around there is be best shot for the the lat to get a sh or sorry the uh, the toe to get a shot on the uh, vehicles. Also, guys, command comms. If I go down, we'll go Silas, Decrum, Fulcrum, Nos, then Paladin. So three one five two four. The British timer has started. Copy that. And they are underway. Everyone has to uh, make their way north here. British only have a limited amount of supply. Actually, what are the British supply? Because I should have actually gone over that. British supply, four logic trucks, and you load one transport truck. They get a tow and an HMG along with defensive structures. Uh, so they get fortifications. Uh... The thing is, they'll be able to put up to two mines on the bridge. Ten wires, ten sandbags on the bridge. They can place AT mines anywhere else. AP mines are not in play. British can cross west after they've been engaged. And vehicles can only uh, be stand by, um, stand by for live. Vehicles can uh, only cross using the contested bridge. That's true for both sides. So no vehicles can just waltz across uh, for British. The only one that can is the BMP, as it is a tracked vehicle. Tracked vehicles can cross the bridge for Russia. The British can resupply all they want for as many mines as they can for as much as their uh, supplies handle. We are live with round one. 
Operation Sleeping Serpents Part 2. Here's the uh, British FOB uh, placed with, you know, no pretension straight in the middle of the field. Uh, we'll take a look at the British toe, which is... Wait. Does this have a line on the... I don't even see the bridge from here. It's supposedly this direction. Silas, make sure your lead vehicles get onto the uh, railroad track. I don't know about that placement. I... Uh, should be jumping on the road. This seems too far back. Try to do that. This seems like 200 meters away from the objective. Like, to me, the objective is here, and you're probably gonna get, you're probably gonna get ganked to your north, to your south. You need to obviously defend the base of the peninsula. But, see, I don't, uh, it, putting the toe back here, I don't know, I don't know what this does. It's so far away. I mean, you never know. You might get lucky and they decide to cross the river here and your toe is useful, but I don't know. Uh, something tells me that uh, the toe placement is not working. And then the HMG back here is just basically to hold the north. But I don't even know if this is even useful. Because you're expecting them to come around behind and someone's in it, like, they're only waiting for people to come from this northern passage, which you're already planning to attack because you have men here. Uh, I, I wish I understood. I really did. We're gonna go with it though. Is there a hold up? Yeah, we just stop to dismount and get eyes out, and then my vehicle's leading. A little earlier than the planned stop point, but you know, it's whatever. Not the worst thing in the world. Vehicles are taking the uh, the railway. They're looking for the tow. They're not gonna find it. Make sure the BMP is getting onto the railroad now and following everyone else up. Dismount. Okay. Dismount. We're all three dead. Morning. Now, these BTRs can't cross the river by themselves. They have to use the bridge. Not that far away, all things considered. And obviously mines galore. There's even a mine up here. It's pretty funny. British down to 3,000 ammo. Which makes sense because I'm uh, pretty sure the tow costs like 1k ammo in the mod. I could be wrong about that, but I'm I'm pretty sure it costs a lot because it has optics on it. Got some Russians in the southern village here. MG. I'll just. I imagine these guys are gonna get shot at. I'll just try and find somewhere tasty looking east across that river to lay down some suppressing fire. Harry, if you've got a better spot for me, Super Rick, just let me All know right, and I'll uh, move there. Start getting yeah, Charlie, I'll now. be your eyes. You guys just focus and, east. Uh, Sots, have you spotted anything across the river yet? 
Keep that fire rate okay. down too. Yeah, I'm what I'm weapons tight until I like this so hill right here. On. Really? Yep. Zero Don't. eight one top of the hill. Z yeah, Don't because they're skylining. Yeah, oh my god. Are they building some yeah. they can't build fortifications up there? No, no. And yet they they have uh they have sandbags. I think Salton Man is, sees these guys potentially. Russia have a lot of firepower for their squad compared to British. Oh, he saw he saw Killer J. Yeah, that's a pretty good shot there, and his MG is definitely gonna have a, have some fun with this here in a sec. It's being super cautious here. Of course, this engagement means the British can cross the uh, river. Brits uh, got a lot of engineers, but they only have too many machine gun four lats for it. They only have oh jeez. Okay, so maybe British are actually better supplied here. Shots fired. The British engaged. Uh, it's a bit over. Uh, it's a bit. It's a bit over excited of an arc there to spray, but you know what? He tried. Got a uh, the northern Russian element looking for a place to cross, and uh, they're not going to be excited about crossing up the uh, hill there. They're going to get shot in the side by the guys on the rocks. Got visual. Oh, I see him, yeah. I don't see shit. They're on the top of the hill. Still doesn't mean I see shit. Oh, they're up there. Uh, you can see, you can barely see Honu up and down here, and they're literally skylining across the top of the hill. They're taking cover from the southern uh, Russian squad. Ooh, here we go. Shots coming in from the BMP. Now it becomes a game of who can hit the 300 meter shot. Russian smoke mortars are coming out. The assault is happening soon. British squad fire team has already crossed the river and the rest of the fire team is joining them. So the British Northern, uh, Northern Patrol is happening. This BMP is gonna be pretty uncontested. They do, the British do have hats and lats. Ooh, and a cluster right here get hit by the BMP. Hawdog and Jam both take frag from some of that HE. Looks like they survive. Jam is still bleeding over there. Clawdog seems to have gotten away without having to use a bandage. Sharp eyes there from Lancer, who's gunning the BMP. The rocks are not safe. Ooh. They're looking around still. Light engagement here. One kill for Russia already. More smokes coming out. Let's take a look at uh, where these smokes are potentially landing here. They get Russia get two mortars for these smokes. Vehicles, I got at least uh, all elements to be advised. I got at least one times AR that's being poking up the top right side of those rocks. Uh, 
All right. That's pretty good smoke right there. They got to spread it out. It's a nice start. Uh, but it it's a nice start, but it's you know it's not there yet. All right, so Silas and Kerr right here are going to be facing down a British squad. Let's see. Ooh, if British sneak up north here, but I don't think they can because this is the map order. I'll get ice on the rocks. Ooh, this is not going to go well for them. If British use this hill, they can basically jump Silas. Uh, meanwhile, more smokes. Well, the Russians, uh, Russians decided to uh, check out, check out without their HE mortar rounds. Smoke mortars uh, rounds are dissipating rather quickly, though, so it has to be continuous barrage. They need to switch to using one, two, three, or they are slower uh, salvos. And here we go. The crossing begins. RPGs rolling out from Br from Russian forces as they storm the river. This is the easy part. Now they have to climb this hill. They have to decide which way they're going to go. They're going to go north side of the... Yeah, it looks like they are. They're going to go north side around. I'm keeping an eye on the... Uh, no, what's going on up here. BTRs are flanking north, and there's like a hat and a lat in this group up here. So the vehicle rating is going to happen. And they have the perfect position. This is the big problem for Russia right now. If they lose all of their firepower to this attack... There's going to be bad times ahead. Kerr and Silas are punching out around the hill. One of the BTRs, Fisco, is stationary. His driver's out. Oh, they want to move a little closer. Could be good. Any chance that British are just going to start shooting here? Yeah, that's a high chance. The hat has killed a vehicle. One BTR down, direct shot, and Silas and Kerr, now Silas is going to go up against an entire squad. Let's all see Silas die. You Kerr run. actually gets two, throws a grenade. Oh, that was so off. They're all clumped up right there. And British are walking away towards the map border. Now they've... Uh, <laughs> What are they going to do? They're going to hold the smallest reverse slope in history? Nope. They're just going to go roll through. The BTR is... The other BTR is turned towards Cyclone and uh, Death Bay Usagi. You're looking for people to shoot. And uh, yeah, Fader's dead. Oh, the British are going to go back west... Or go back east. And Silas and Kerr, they're gonna roll away. BTR down for Brits. Uh, we'll take that. Russia, on the other hand, have pretty much exterminated this top hill. Jam and exoskeleton, the last ones remaining. More smokes coming in to try to shield more of the uh, British assault here. Our, Brit our British defense from um, fire on the Russians. Jam goes down. Here comes Hovis looking for the kill on Exoskeleton. Bada bing. Skeleton not looking f or not ready for it. And as far as the bridge goes, still pretty open. Lots of uh, lots of eye lines here. You've got the. Uh, Guys of the hill are actually pulled back because they're just taking too much fire. Meanwhile, these guys adjacent to the road still have eyes on the bridge. North, the northern Brits are hugging the map border, wishing they're not, or hoping for not dying. Hoping for not dying. Let's use words. Hoping to not die. Um, or silence the hat there. They have an engineer with them. 
All the vehicles looks like they're rolling north now. Oh, hey, look at that. The uh, BMP is just rolling across the river. forces have a uh, squad they're coming up the other peninsula to the south squad four is repositioning to start clearing the bridge two mines on the bridge plus all of those obstacles and if the infantry is going to have to clear and if, the, if the infantry is going to clear the oh we uh, got a little bit of rubber banding going on there the speed they're gonna have to seize the engineer to um take stuff down the engineer's got the uh, super spade I got the fast spade. Oh, oh Fisco in chat. <laughs> I felt too safe up there in the BTR. I knew it was too good to be true. Yeah, well. I don't know. The. Oh, Oddball is striking at the right time here. The defense here. I would have liked to seen a little bit more here. The tow is manned and looking for people to shoot, but it has no direct line on the bridge. So, I mean, I mean, if I were British, I would just go park my vehicles right here and say, I'm on the east side of the river. Let's go. Uh, yeah, we're heading up now. British pretty smart here, throwing a squad in as the Russians start clearing the river. They got smokes here to Careful, just... Don't run into a barbed wire, I can tell you. Yeah. Lima 347, we got contacts in. Can we get another smoke out? Lima 347, copy. Have we, uh... The British need to start engaging these guys on the bridge if they're going to slow this down. Negative, Matt. Copy that. Two, one, to push with just left their ammo bag there bruh bruh moment indeed and here's charlie foxtrot man if he had eyes he'd have a squad lead kill right now fallen apollo behind is running straight towards the russian or straight towards the british line he's about to be executed British throwing smokes anywhere as possible. Chicken is over. Chicken's over there too. Five's gonna have to push through. They're on the halfway point. Volcom's running back. Uh, what are the British doing? Are they just holding position? Because they're not. They're running away too. Probably because they're about to lose the foothold and it's not going to matter anyway. Russia have just basically swept over the hill here and they're using the BMP. The tow is not effective. Is the tow doing anything? The tow is blocked by a tree, guys. What is this tow position? Wait, it's behind... No, okay, it has line of sight if the tree wasn't there. So as long as the Bondarch just gets lasered by the uh, HE here, and there goes uh, more dying here right now. 18 kills for Russia. The round is by no means over, but it is uh, becoming bad news unless the tow can actually get a shot on this BMP. British are being engaged, or Br British are engaging Russians behind them. They were able to sneak past, but uh, Rebel Pelican's friggin' dead. They're looking for a shot on the BMP, and they're not gonna have it. 
Viper and Cobra still crawling along the shoreline there. We got Greg Pants. Got hit once. And go, gets hit a second time and goes down. Russian forces on the hilltop here. Cobra also dead. Also dead, Cobra. The worst news reporting ever there. Viper is stuck on this smoke. He's gonna have to crawl up the uh He's got a whole squad looking at him right now. So bad news. Meanwhile, Russia have basically basically cleared the bridge. Uh but it looks like uh Fulcrum got killed over here. They're looking for these guys on the peninsula here. Looking for Oddball's fire team. Yes. Right. <laughs> Can you disengage? Yes. Okay. And looks like they're actually going to disengage. They got a uh, tiger up there helping. Legar has got to get a kill with this. Legar's got to get a kill with this toe. They want to bait it into the field, but it's not going to matter. The toe is a force multiplier, and the British have no force. All right, here we go. This is the best shot the toe is going to get. If Legar needs to shoot now. Legar needs to shoot now. Legar shooting. <laughs> and the BMP's on fire immediately gets out. They need to repair. If they started repairing the BMP, they could save it. If the BMP's not down, you could have saved it. They gave up on the BMP at half health. They could have saved it if they started repairing it, guys. I swear. I swear that's a thing. I've seen it before. It can happen again. The vehicles have made it across, so technically mission accomplished. Russians are now across, so... Uh, British have to destroy Russian vehicles. The BMP's down. Been doing vanilla squad. Okay, vanilla squad. You may have a point there, but even then, like, all Russia have to do is park the vehicle in such a way to not get shot by the tow. Uh, so far, so good here. It's basically, Russia just skylining on this hillside right here. They're gonna be looking for this. Uh, they're gonna be looking for this right, tow position, but I don't think they saw the uh, the position for the tow. RPGs coming in all over the place. There's a fire. A British fire team sort of in this half hill here, and they're holding ground. They're holding their ground. There's so many Russians, though. The Russians are spilling out around the north side. Hovis leading the group in the low ground. Four RPGs coming in. I don't even... That was almost a hit. There is an HMG in the back. Free Stalker on the HMG back here. Ventric and Sven. Sven commanding British this round. I mean, I guess they're just trying to bait him up the hill. If they get up on the hill, the HMG might be able to traverse over there and shoot him. But... Uh, stalker off. 
Russia on 29 kills right now. British on seven. So far as a spectacular, it's a, it's a pretty rough failure for British right now. They're not winning the gunfights at range. They're getting walked all over. There's a three strong, a three squad strong push here by, by Russia, supported with vehicles. And regardless of the toast position, the Russia, Russia is just setting up vehicles here anyway. Is that a lap? Legar is still, Legar is not in the tow anymore. Oh no, yeah he is. Oh no he's not, he's not on the toe, he's just prone and his feet are in the air. Okay squad, way to go with these animations. Uh, fire team up the hill here, head bust Decrum. Decrum leading these guys up the hill. I think this is where Sven was. Sven's gone down the hill to rejoin. Squad three, check fire. Copy. Watch out, Deacon. Fire team. On the other side of this rock. Free Stalker is right next to the HMG. The HMG is not a uh, not one of the swivel and traverse tripods. Instead of this one of the six degree boys. But I do want you to push forward. How strong are you right now? How many you got up? Killer J and Levin the dude. Oh, the fire team in the middle was running back. Happy Glamper gets shot in the back. Russia are just walking up here confidently. More shots coming in. Thrasher just gets deleted. I th no, Thrasher's Russia. Whatever. This is or no, Thrasher red, red British. Duh. Thrasher definitely gets uh definitely did just get deleted there. But uh, Happy Clamper makes it, and Le Levi is um. Eventually, I'll have you move to my position, and you'll set up a new base of fire here. One continuous. We're just gonna take a shot at him. Oh. Copy that. And the Brit, uh, the Russian. Oh my gosh. Oh. The mind games right now that I'm doing to myself is just ridiculous. Command, be Very strong here. Now they haven't cleared all the. Uh, Mines on the road, but I guess they don't have to. Here comes a uh, two squad push BTR and Tiger in tow. Am I okay, dude? No, dude, I'm not okay. I'm on three hours sleep, guy. <laughs> there we go. I'm on three hours sleep, and I've only had one cup of coffee. So, actually, it's not red blast. I know, Brits are red now. RPG goes out, and I think that actually got a few hits there. Brits are pretty concentrated. Killer J is about ready to get shot in the back. And realizes being shot at and gets back behind cover. King. Ooh, that's a nice frag. It actually hits Killer J pretty uh, extensively here. It's uh, Meep. Two shifted to me now. Shifted east. And you're going to set up on this one. Uh, All right. Uh, Russia starting the leapfrog position here. And they have. They're sneaking up on the toe from behind. Legar's not gonna, really going to know what hit him. Let's go watch Legar get killed. Oh, toe. No. Oh, a multi kill. Toast and Hobus get deleted while Decrum and Lewis are both hit. Right now. Not in time to save some people. Legar does get executed for his. Uh... I probably clipped the mic there. I'm sorry about that. But. Legar MVP for British. Winning the moral victory as best you can while your, the rest of your team gets annihilated. 31 kills, Russia. 9 for British now. Stop. The BTR now operating behind the, are on the east side of the river with impunity. A toe to the west. We got uh, plus one Tigger. I think the second one's right here somewhere. Russia now own the low position. I've been logged out of restream for no reason. And I think I think part of it's open to the west. 
The yeah, stream is still working, but. Oh, the BTR got hit. BTR stationary definitely did get hit. And King is going to use the uh, smoldering remains of the BTR as a bit of a cover here. I mean, in the grand scheme of things, do British win here? And the answer is no. I don't think the Brit I don't think British win here with ten players. Hold on, let's see. Five. Ten. Yeah, I don't think British win here with ten players. They might get some kills on JV over here. JV fire team took out. Oh, and now they're getting shot at up over the hill. Gimli Tron and Charlie Foxtrot. An oddball are sneaking up on these guys. Super fires on. Oh. oh, double kill grenade actually went through the ground. Either that or is the best grenade throw ever, and it actually landed on top of the sandbag. I'm not sure what happened there, but we're going to go with the grenade was good. That's what I'm going to go with. Uh, it's just Patrick and Chicken over here on the uh, west side. And they are going to distract some. Two squads are Russians. Two and a half squads are Russians. Still running around over here like they just don't care. But a squad of British. We got the... Uh, all the smokes here. Russia are going to run to the next set of buildings. Last river uh, gets destroyed by, I think it's a tiger over here somewhere. I right over top of it? Yes, I am. One, two, three. Four. Killer J gets hit. I don't think he was expecting the Russians to exist here. Oh, the toe is up. What? The toe is up. The toe is up. Lancer gets hit. Wait, Lancer was... Oh, yeah, Lancer did just get hit. I'm sorry. I'm still trying, still trying to catch up here. Lancer actually was on the... Uh, he was on the uh, BMP at one point, I believe. It's... Finally killed by the toe. Oddball one shot him. That seems to be the toe's value right now. 18 kills for Brits, the 35 for Russia. The defense is going in British's favor for right now, but Russia have a pretty strong position here. And they have swept around southwest side of this uh, villa. Paladin leading these guys in. I think he just killed two men right there. It's just Killer J here, so we are getting towards the end of it. Oh, only one mag. Fuck. Russia running low on ammo. Spen is in the middle of the field here, just chilling. Oddball, don't get shot. Gimli Tron holding out on the toe. It's kind of the biggest val asset for British here, and I guess the toe doesn't use 1k per shot because still 2k ammo. Chicken is trying to take on the three guys here defending the toe. Clear him out. We killed two that were trying to run west, Decker. Copy that. We are pushing in now. Sure Meanwhile, the villa has been cleared, and it's going to take a second for Russia to re Russia to realize it's done. Once that happens, one, we're going to work on getting guys to take down that fucking radio that's in the middle of that fucking uh, field. Yo, baby. So the radio is now the goal for uh, Russia here. Right, oh, uh, Bojo Loco. Where's that radio? Copy that one. Oh, what is this? This is my, so my funny. Bravo fire team is right next to the radio. And he's looking for where they were. And Spen is camping the radio. One, I want you setting up 
up around here. Russia have swept all the way around the village, and now they're looking to retake the tow position. Don't get shot as dead to chicken, meanwhile. And Gimletron is fi openly firing on uh, Russians south or the uh, the North Hill. Ooh, Koops gets shot by Oddball trying to cross the uh, river there. Black comes in. A miss on Gimli. In between us and you. Yo. Oddball has all the targets potential, all targets in front of him. Right now, we got four British remaining. Round one, pretty solid victory for Russia. Although the uh, the last part here not uh, is wow wow oddball just decapitated storm out of the tight uh, uh, right there I thought he was in the tiger but he's not or maybe he was and now liberals in the tiger not entirely sure what's going on there is a tiger or a tiger. Tiger, whatever. Uh, Gimletron still uh, came behind this uh, tree here, waiting for something to happen. Meanwhile, Sven kills King as the Russians are starting to move in. I don't think they know. Oh, Napa sees him. Napa sees commands. Sven's dead. El Bojo Loco, last one in here. Round two. Now I fall asleep. Bro, it's a good thing I have stuff on my bed right now because I would lay down. I would probably lay down between rounds and like close my eyes for two seconds. I'd be done. Gimletron's dead, so I guess it's down to Oddball here. Oddball's gonna YOLO. Oh, Elbo Loco's still in the north field. Tiger. That's what I thought. Because. Russian. Four, get your guys moving west. Or west southwest. You gotta clear out this guy. More casually is starting to come up here. Appa gets killed. El Bojo Loco at the radio. I think they set a uh, time charge here. Decrum's running away. Now Bojo Loco taking uh taking fire now from a tiger. And they know exactly where this guy is, and he's not long for this world. Oppal's dead in the south. A ball loco. Oh, a TK. Big sad. Curtils. Curtils Sasa. And there goes a ball loco. He's done. And uh, that's uh, pretty much it. Aside from the TK there, pretty strong performance from Russia. 43 kills all told to 23 from British. I, I mean, I get I, this is the, I get the end game the British were planning for. I get the end game the British were playing for. I don't really get the. Uh, we're just gonna stop here because there's no more. Uh, no more. No more uh, Brits alive here, and uh, EA will come to that conclusion here shortly. That sound. What's that? Why am I seeing chat twice here? I don't understand. The... Wait, is there... Are there's... Is, is there someone alive still for British? There's the GG call. Oh my gosh. Round one done. We're going to be taking a short break here for part two or for round two rather Woo. okay three o'clock all right doing okay Let's see who got the most kills here chicken got four not bad uh two the tow launcher didn't get any kills there's no way he must have disconnected okay so that's in that we will be back shortly. Yes.
but back shortly with round two. Squad leads. Sven will be going over the plan here shortly. Oddballs, his second in command, I believe. Um, Rubba, Rubba, Killer J, and Cartel? Question right. mark. Cool. Welcome to the second round, everybody. Here we uh, go. First round one. Okay. Um, so, we have to assault the radio bridge. The I-8, H-8 mark. The mine mark is where. So, squad one, squad two, squad four, and squad five. Oh, hey. We're all going to move <laughs> south. And then we're going to cross the G-10 area. Move north on a platoon line along the river. Uh, if you guys see the marks, four, five, one, and two, that kind of style. Three, you're going to have BTRs in the north, providing support. And you're going to move your cords to the three mark and look east into radio tower. Make sure you're not getting hit with any toes or anything. Any questions? No. Uh, squad leaders break them out to their vehicles. Okay. We're live. Yeah, I think he knows we're live. We're gonna go ahead and join a squad here so we can get some communications. Those things are spacious. Spacious. Oh, oh my god. Dude, uptown when you got I'm shot, triggered. I'm, for sure. I'm actually there. triggered. Right next to you. Yeah. Yeah, I was to your right, I think. Yeah. Spacious vehicle salesman, but a bing. Yeah, I mean, okay, so we have command comms now. Yeah, I thought I was hitting him too. I don't. I thought you got shot. From I the like bridge. this. All the numbers and stuff, guys. It's a very organized plan here. You can see what's happening. One, two, four, five. South and north. Three with the vehicles moving directly across. They're also in charge of their uh, their off point support here. That's pretty good. I like this plan. A lot more of a uh, off-balance plan than I think no more seats in here Russia there. had last round. I'm already in here. Uh, could find just, uh, so we'll see. Uh, we'll see what going on. What's what'll end up happening here? Everything is starting to proceed as far as the columns we made here. No one's left yet, even though we are alive. So British are getting all that extra time. For some reason, British also on 950 ammo. <laughs> which doesn't bode well for Russia trying to cross this bridge. Um, bridge location here. Once again, all we can see right now, we can see a, uh, a we can see the tow. We do not see the HMG. All right, might be getting a pause here. Some of my guys are in a vehicle. Can they take one of the trans? No, I'm in a large truck. Uh, they can have it with me. Copy. Got a hold from our admin here, so the column is ceased position i guess we're waiting the vehicles are rolling now oh wait what why are they Is that what happened? I did spawn in vanilla once. Okay. If you're so we. Standby. I got it. I have the dock. It's mine. What vehicles is it? Flicker. It's, it's just two BT. It's Rubba's got it. It's two. It's two BTR 80s and one BMP2. All right. If you guys are in the BMP or the BTRs, have your eyes hop out. And they're gonna have the new ones. All right. A little bit of a a uh, little bit of a shove going on here. So apparently the uh, wrong vehicles were spawned in, which would definitely give away the uh, the surprise here. 
because of the vehicle. I mean, if you can see the vehicle on the map, it's kind of bad news. Vehicle is not affected. I am going to move out. Squad 5 is moving out. All right, looks like you guys are sorted. I'm going over to the other team. Good luck. Go flicker. Hold yeah, on. we'll need it. What about, what about the BMP? You're getting that spawned in from Rubba. Rubba's copy. All three have been spawned in. Right, yeah, it looks like we're good. Yeah, just a little, just a little, you know, yeah, it's, it's fine. Bad. It happens. Then you got to check to make sure none of the vehicles leaving main are uh, spotable. When it happens, we just keep it cordial. Where, where did the BMP spawn? This is a one life operation, uh, Con 848. So the idea is that uh, everyone only lives once. Once you hit the downed state, when where you need a bandage and vanilla play to uh, get you back up, you actually just give up because you're done. You're done. And about 99% uh, of operations run for squad ops um, that are actually in squad. Um, you know, they don't have revive rules. There is that 1% of operations that have revive rules. But it is not this op. Ooh. Unban requests? We get those? Okay, got it. Ooh, okay. I, uh, I'm not gonna touch those. <laughs> Uh, all right. Get to, uh, the F10 grid. Have you guys halt, dismount, and uh, hold there. Do you want my squad moving north immediately? Um, make sure they're together before they move north. But yeah. All right. So. Three. This is one. Go for three. Just making sure you're aware you are missing some crewmen. I need only four. Um, oh, you might have three in one, Vic, then. Okay. Yeah, that, that's it. All right. Yeah, you do. And the VMP's back here. A little bit of a uh, slow start here. This is going to be all sorts of a little weird here. So we're just going to breathe. Uh, kind of asking squad ops server anyone can join. Um, we do have public servers. We don't run the one life operations on them. However, we uh, do uh, allow players to join in these operations. They take a basic SOTT course, which is our squad ops tactics and training. We take a basic and doc course, and uh, that's when you can participate um, in our one life operations. Uh, we do run armor events, although you need armor foundations for that, which pretty much get run before every run armor event because apparently there's not. <laughs> I haven't seen a like a big armor event yet. It's a thing that we're experimenting with, but I guess we're doing. I don't know whatever Russians looking to make their river crossing in the south um, looking east three squads worth on point plus one coming in the BTR maybe there's actually four here they're just they uh, dismounted a little while away a little ways away 200 meters to run 300 meters or so Dog wants to go out. Medic only for healing? That's true. Medic only for healing and also for putting on bandages really fast. People still bleed in this mod. So you still need to kind of uh, get people to stop bleeding. Command, so. this is one. We are dismounted and in position. All right. Um, is everyone here? Negative. We're, we're, we only got the BMP. We're about halfway there. Okay, um, that's fine. Squad three, start pushing. Actually, all the squads start pushing your locations. Infantry start crossing the river. 
I'm gonna set up a uh, mortar fire up okay. north. Let's uh, go up here and take a look at the British position. The British are stuck on the east side of the river until contact has been called. Oh boy, okay, so we got one squad at the back to prevent them from getting completely backstabbed. One squad on the point, one north, watching the riverside, one inside the uh, radio tower. Oh, that's the radio tower here. And then one along the uh, the northwest side of the radio tower. Nobody on the tow right now. And uh, here's what we're looking at from the uh, tow position, from the uh, radio tower. Uh, please do so. Roger, five, take the lead. I'm covering. Yeah, I think we're on the right one here. Uh, let's take a look at the bridge. Ooh, boy. Hey. Killer. Yes. Yes, one of your guys pushing me right now. I need to get a radio down. Here's the bridge to get all the sandbags and razor wire to deploy on the bridge to, well, they get 10 of them. That's less than 10. To your east. Uh, any mines on the bridge? They can't be dug down on the bridge, but they can exist. Uh, is that 33 meters? Yeah, that's fine. So we got one at the end of the bridge, one right in the middle. So it should be seen it right there. And at the end of the bridge, right there. Pretty obvious positions. And then uh, mines can be dug down outside. We got four mines in the near vicinity. Can you spot the mine? Where's that last tiger? It's probably an ops tiger. It doesn't show up on the map. Well, I don't see it, so I can't take it. I didn't spawn any more in. Five advisement set. Roger. So there's. Oh, I'm confused. Uh, the Russians have crossed the river. And the vehicles are up here in the north. Take a look at this. And for some reason. There we go. Hey, uh, killer. Make sure you guys are. Not enough elevation. Spotted by the enemies. I already told them that. Man, you're in my brain. Alright. Squad 5 uh, No eyes on contact. I'm retarded. Roger 5, one's move. Nah, you're just. That's wrong. Yeah, the, so they're holding position, waiting for coming in to expose themselves, I guess, yeah, oh is what's yeah. happening. And it's BTR and team. one of the Tigers. Second BTR on the way. And we have a smoke mortar up. And a second squad is now transiting the river. Once you're across one, I'm going to start taking it out east. Hey, firm. And there's the BMP down here. Then you're gunning for lawn darts driving. Do you want my uh, fire team up there to start shooting now? To get them distracted, they have my BTR shoot from the west. Um, I, want you to, I, want you to I wonder if and take two will just start running right. immediately Let's start. after contact is called here. Copy. Uh, be advised to have a smoke board up for you guys, so I should be able to hit anywhere we need. We get to go see my two nephews today, so that's exciting. Nice. Command one. Go command. I haven't really been able to see him. Our level standing zone here has been established. Would you like us to continue proceeding with the plan, or do you that's want us to wait until two gets all the way down here? Yeah. They can't cross the water next to the bridge. Infantry can cross wherever they want. Wheeled vehicles may not cross the river except for by the specific bridge. I'm working. So, for this operation, the Russian wheeled vehicles can only cross on this bridge. However, 
They do have one uh, exception to that rule. Or oh, it's not really an exception. It's an explicit uh, way that the operation is designed. The tracked vehicle may cross the river at its discretion. Infantry can walk over. The only restrictions are on wheeled vehicles have to use this bridge. Which means, Rush, you have to clear it. Which is the main draw on the operation, distracting British forces long enough so that the Russian forces come in here and get yeah. themselves uh, a nice bridge to cross. Everything comes across. Now, that worked out in the north because... What do you do for a living? British just didn't have... Right now, I work construction. What about British you? British just didn't have the uh, the numbers to defend up here and they didn't have any uh hard like defense up here their goal their goal in round one was to try to get them to fall back here to this field so the tow could just keep sniping them and the tow got the vehicles but they can't win down you know when you're out number two to one it's very difficult to come back two to one uh like that so british lost this particular instance is kind of different because the radio tower here you got more elevated positions you have a straight shot onto the bridge itself and the way that this uh, terrain is situated makes it very advantageous i believe for the defenders now not enough defending here also squad two is missing i wonder where they're at Oh, if they move south, how smart is freaking Alpha? No, they're still here. They're holding back. They are moving. So I guess they're just situation, situating themselves. I can't see much from where I am. I guess they're anticipating a north attack. There is a problem with that plan, and I don't. I believe that is. I don't think they can proceed north of the five six line. Also, Russia can't proceed south of like ten eleven. So they're kind of stuck into this uh, little, they're kind of actually, they're pretty much stuck into like these five rows of grid squares to maneuver and defend. Of course, the British can move west of the river after they've taken contact, which hasn't happened yet. Although these BTRs keep, the BTR and the Tiger up here keep moving around as if they're about ready to start shooting. I believe they're going to start scanning for targets now, okay, though. Copy. Fine, this is one. I'm going to move yeah, around to the east. Yeah, you guys need fucking three money, though. That's for sure. Clear that compound for me. Yeah, uh, yes. Yes. Fog, so Copy. Roger. Move up to that tree a little bit. We got our uh, contract coming up here pretty soon, so hopefully we'll get another yeah, raise. Uh, Nice. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. It's supposed to go up. Yeah, oh, shit. Fucking everyone goes out and votes, but usually doesn't happen. Well, yeah, last year, last year, last year, last year. Three you squads now across, like, and I believe the BMP is going to make its way as well. Yeah, that bush was in the way. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. I'm going to have to move closer because I don't see anything. Alright, sounds good. Do what you need to do. Okay, we're kind of... Okay, we're kind of, um... I'm kind of pointing up a little bit. Is there any way you can roll us to the right a little bit? Stop, stop, stop. Alright, let's go with SL. Okay. Right, there, you can't can. drive into a tree, my guy. Okay, don't take the road, though. Okay. Squad 5, Squad 4, Squad 1 making their way to their uh, run position here. And BTR is now getting recalled to Squad 3, so I guess they're going to start uh, thinking about pushing the bridge here soon. How 
I think people move on. Bill J looking for people. Hadn't seen anyone. Where is he looking? Anyone he should be seen? Let's see. Uh, these guys are pretty far away. All the fog. Not really skylining. Yeah, I think so. Keep it nice and wide, I guess. Yeah, let's do it. One's punching out east. Oh, speaking of punching out east, uh, squad two. Alright, enemy contacts in the compound I-716 on the south side. That's nice radio tower. So, uh, in radio tower actual. You see a radio in it at all? There's the HMG, by the way. Fulcrum running the HMG at base. Straight south pointed. Oh, uh, it's pretty good. <laughs> oh, man. That's going to be a really good HMG. Negative. Squad 2 moving out to the west here is going to be, or to the east here is pretty strong. Let's take a look at these positions for Rishi, or for British. Rusher. There's a radio tower. They just called out contact here. Probably skyline the bridge through the uh, fence rather or it could be super duper rick is just like half hanging out here like a mad lad uh and of course the uh, railway here you can see the uh, radio that's a rally radio there's the radio and fulcrum oh what a position that's not going to be the most ideal, but it's going to be pretty good. And look, it's even got an ACOG on it. So super OP mode, activate. Good copy. Eight, five, four, this is one. Uh, Slowly getting towards contact. Our, um, Soon, angle. I hope. Yep, okay. Understood. Hold, wait for one to get Take online with you guys. Why a ping? Moshka asking, how do you join these events? You take basic on our calendar on our website. You gotta sign up and link your Discord account. When you join the Discord, you uh, perform the last part of the linking there. Uh, and then you join, you take a SOT basic. Our basic course is our indoctrination course, allows you to sort of learn what we expect from players. Of course, you also have to be 18 and not previously banned and all that jazz. But once you take basic, you can sign up for pretty much any squad event on the calendar. BTR looking for people to shoot. I don't know what this is all about, though. This is not the direction they want to be facing. Yeah, I can't see anything here. Uh, uh, that's an understatement. You can't see anything there. It's going to be kind of hard to see anything from here. Through the trees? There's only one lat. Oh, the, there's a hat. Okay, so there's a hat in, off the radio tower. Then two lats at the radio tower. All right, I'm going to open fire south of the tower. You ready? Oh. Yep, I'm ready with that. I'm ready with that. Okay, so Russia has formed the line, and I think right, Squad right, 2 right. slipped off again. Keep slow, keep to the speed. east side. Oh, look at that. They came around. Silas with the mad jukes. Let's take a look and see. Oh, there's a... There's... There's no way Russia know about this. Squad one, say when you're happy to move uh, for us. You guys are good to go. We're going to take up a better position. I mean, there's really... The only chance to see these guys cross is here. Sal has got these guys so spaced out, though. And nobody's looking to the east. Toasty is. Does Toasty see anything? Nope. He's on the move. Russia... Behind schedule. 
looking at us. Probably. Let's yeah. just make sure we keep our spacing. Rubba. And Charlie, really, uh, pushies, pushies. Really yep. Rubba and his guys look like they want to push more east, and so we're going to have two squads crash directly into the point. Silas running around behind. Pretty much has an open field, even though he's running through a forest. The BMP is still holding back. No shots fired in anger yet. I mean, there were some shots earlier, but I mean, nothing came of it. We're still basically zero zero. Uh, repeat last four. We have eyes on heavy barricades around the intersection of J744. Sven, can we open up with this BTR or this BMP? Yeah, fucking light him up, guys. Uh, squad three starts pressing. BMP got engaged from 600 meters. Yeah, keep going. Oh, the tow launcher. I guess he's using the tow. Uh, HE being deployed. No joy yet. Rush is getting pretty close to the edge here. The BMP is engaging from all the way over here. How in the crap? I guess there's definitely uh, some magnification here for the BMP. Let's take a look and see what uh, Londarts is shooting at. Uh, that's probably enough for me. You want help back in? Oh yeah, he's firing blind. I mean, I, he's got to be firing blind. I can't see anything. So much fog. Persons 2.0 game freezes on loading screen. Well, I don't know. Reset preps. Big shrug. Uh, the game's never run better for me, to be honest with you. BMP on the road, rolling out hard. Wow, British even throwing a vehicle to help block off the road here at the intersection. Silas and his guys are moving pretty fast here, and uh, Storm leading the way. Kerr got a uh, AT4 out looking for a vehicle to shoot. And it is going to be potentially very, very happy in about 60 seconds. If he can leg it fast enough to get to the road. Might even get a shot on this vehicle from behind if the vehicle decides not to go in. The advantage of approaching from the south here is Russia get to follow through the forest. Disadvantage is they got to fight forest to forest. They also have to cross this uh, opening here. It's gonna be kind of difficult. Russians are engaging. And they are making progress. They're getting really close up here in the east. Polish Serb is about to be uh, stomped on. He's, he's crawling away. Shoot him! Shoot him! Space out! Space out! All right, does Joker realize what's going on to his left, or is he AFK? He's not AFK. I see him moving. I'm gonna maneuver for a position. Rubba sees him. Roger. Hey, you guys see North Northwest 305? There's a There's guy a crawling. Some sandbags, they're probably in there. Throw some yeah. rounds that way. I'm gonna mark it with red smoke. Hey, Bravo, make sure you keep an eye north because we had sandbags that direction as well. Fire on that red smoke. This goes in sandbags. Ace Joker does get hit, but uh, it's kind of off. Silas has got his guys regrouped here, uh, but we still have Kerr looking for the BMP. It's already moved all the way up here towards the bridge. Bridge crossing largely, uh, largely given up. What was that? Oh, they shot out. Doesn't look like hills. Pretty light on kills right now. Three kills for Russia to one for Brits. 
and they've secured the area but they gotta be careful because i would not drive this intersection or anywhere close to it russians on foot moving in a fire team plus size force smoke mortars coming down Yeah, rocks 326332. See how much easier it is to see infantry on the map when they have blue is still Russia. When uh they have outlines. OWI, do you see this? Do you see how great this is for for broadcast when you see infantry just walking around with these outlines? Now let's make them for everyone. B3, we believe. Uh, Silas is now shooting, or will be soon be shooting Russians in the back if he's not already. Uh, has eyes on Cyclone, but uh, better do something about it quick. Marking red smoke, marking red smoke. Ooh, that's uh, pretty good. I've got to see. Russians begin clearing the bridge. Nice in the north has been pulled off the uh, ridge line up here. Probably for good. The vehicles have redeployed. Okay, there we go. Actually, they were always there. Those vehicles were always there. BMP is holding position while Russians begin clearing the bridge from both sides. Not using an engineer to do it, though. I don't see an engineer over here. Rubba and his fire uh, squad are fighting off multiples over here. Oh man, look at that smoke. Somebody shot a smoke and hit a tree. Oh man, that's such a huge... Uh... I guess it's fire... I guess it's Silas and his fire team leader are shooting smokes here just trying to uh, get these guys to... Get their vision blocked off here. That's so funny. First, sneaking up behind this BMP, close to within 200 meters, and they are making some progress. They're largely unchecked. They still got a long ways to go to get that clear shot off. More mortars laying in the background. More smoke mortars. As this, you can see the British position here. The main fob, all the fortification is it has, and then it rolls through opposite side of the road to the drive where the ra drive up to the radio, the tree line there around the. Uh, is that a lake? That's not a lake. That's something over there. The ditch, uh, and then uh, we've got the radio tower itself here. The BMP is moving. Now, it's got to stay clear this intersection. Also, directly north of the FOB, there's a bunch of mines. Oh. Looks like Kerr got spotted and Storm is dead. Storm, uh, Kerr and Hood are the only two here. And I guess they're going to sneak away. They're going to try to sneak away. They're prone in a way. Good shots. Free Stalker and El Bo Loco are running after them to make it work. So far, so good. British forces. Significant casualties over here on the east side. Rebels down to a fire team size force. And he's withdrawing. Tie dyed dude live just gets shot in the back as he's running away. Because they ran across an open field. No, I heard that. That was, it was a very funny, isolated incident there. And a Rob Pelican gets away. Losing another member of his team. It's just him. Yeah, it's just Rubba. Rubba gets away with his life. But that could be good. I mean, you know, maintain command chain, as it were. What's he shooting at? Rubba is bleeding out. 
Yeah, so Nas came down to reinforce Silas. Rebel is... I guess Rebel's out of bandages, so he's going to go down for sure. Meanwhile, objective complete shortly. They just have to undi They still have to uh, dig down all the uh, fences on the bridge, and it looks like that's actually happened. They've swept it for mines. Looks like everything's gone. Off while providing some cover fire there. Oh, here we go. Hovis rolling around up here in the north. They just crossed the river and made it happen. So, recap. Russia still had BMP. One BTR. One Tiger. Nine kills. To British on 17. Clearly, British winning the gunfights here. Uh, there's also the big banner of wiping an entire squad. The, the sneak from behind wipe was pretty good. Can you hit the BMP just can't roll up here though. That's a sad thing. And that's straight northeast one. I think it's ours. Hey guys. I don't have depression. Is anything north you, wanna, you wanna drop smoke? Dentrick, you get ready to drop smoke so the infantry can get up here. Yeah, you ready? They're, they're, I'm ready. They're up here already. Is that Mons, they're already up here. Pop it up. Oh, they're already up here. Hang on, just, hang on, I'm just gonna pop yeah, it. Yeah, they're up here. Pop they're up here. Man, I don't have depression either, but dang on. Nice smoke screen by the BMP causes the toe to miss. Yeah, maybe don't cross the road, my guy. Oh, he's got to be careful though. Lots of mines around the uh, in intersection here. If he, th if he thinks about just making a shot across, it's not going to be good. Russia have seemed to let the guard down, try to clear mines. Nice call out there, India 7 3. Alright, no, can you look at uh, 355 for me? 355? And you're good here. Smoke is on radio tower, and there's reinforcements falling back to defend the fence. Looks like we're gonna start seeing some HE come in too. Super Duper Rick got, I think, just sniped by the BTR. Now, there's the tow position. Patrick. And yes, it says Patrick. 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 I guess it's how north you are that you start, you start hearing the rope. Further south you are, I guess you're you're hearing the same thing. Is it really the same thing? I don't know. Where are you going? Sven doing a pretty decent job of just keeping the pump out the mortars, but it looks like we're gonna have the uh looks like Sven's gonna get hunted down here. And uh Command's dead. Is Oddball still alive? Yes. Oddball's five. So Oddball's at the bridge, so he's gonna have to lead this thing from here without mortar support. 
Nas has swept all the way around and he's starting to come in behind the uh, bridge element now to the south. Here comes the assault. Multiple smoke mortars have landed. British losing another man coops on the uh, the central line. He's going to back up here. Bluffs McGruffs is the hat. Probably going to give a shot at uh, this. Going to get a shot, a rear shot on this BMP. Two kills for lawn darts in the BMP. Shred Turtle and Chiba Brother. I mentioned I got tied up. I'm top seven. Oh, infantry. Oh, infantry. Plus McGuffs with the rear shot. BMP just got destroyed from the southeast. Yeah, I see it. Ace Joker gets the uh, hit. I'm kind of surprised he's still alive, to be honest with you. BMP down. And uh, Sven is dead. We knew that was going to happen. So now there's another. No one knows Sven is dead. Meep and Ovis are gonna roll up to the uh, northeast here and uh, get a kill on a, B on a BTR. BMP getting destroyed. El Bolo Loco's over here by himself. Got a pretty narrow reverse slope here that he's defending. Free Stalker's running away from him. Big yikes. And Russia don't have the numbers here. 14 to 20. They've been clawing it back, but it's uh, British are still maintaining a pretty significant lead. Wow, they're basically shooting right beside El Bojo. Welcome. Russia needs a... I thought Russia were assaulting the radio tower. What happened to that? Oh, it's happening over here. Oddball is going to lead an assault and probably die, which is going to mean a lot more command fragmentation is going to happen here very shortly. Appa and Toast are up the hill here. Plus, I imagine Headbuster and Decorum are going to be able to support as well. Appa is looking that direction. Toast is not going to be able to support immediately. Let's see here. Yeah, Decorum is in the tree line. I think Appa's just started engaging. Have we cleared these bridges of mines so the tiger can cross? Steve-O asking the good question, not getting an answer because apparently no one cares. Oddball's dead. Command. That's what happened just then. Wow. Did I call that or what? Did I call that right now? And another original squad lead is dead. Steve-O gets sniped from the ridge line. East of the point. The original command looks like uh, Killer J is now in charge. Grenades going in and the Brits have given up radio tower except for the fire team to the north. And Killer J realizes this is in charge, I think. They're gonna fall back through the radio, but they're definitely gonna fall back to the uh, right, the to position here. Tower. Slowly getting closed in behind. One lat down behind. Looks like the BTR is. Uh, someone took a shot at the BTR and uh, now realizes that there's a thing to do. Hey, dude, fucking, yep, yeah, right there. Stop right there. Hold so on, I friend. think Lewis. Right in these fucking trees right here, dude. Oh, Hovis has it. Two five eight. Right in these fucking trees. Hovis has the AT. 
Holmes is dead. Oh, he had a tube out and everything. Okay, so Lewis can't do anything by himself. These guys need to get in the war here, but they gotta be careful crossing this bridge. So many mines. Not still rolling around the southeast side of the AO. Russia whittling, being whittled down as they crash against uh, everyone across the river. It looks like they've now moved up to uh, the radio tower. Skrevsky. Breaking the wall here to the north. Leading, leading uh, acting in, as a squad lead. They haven't completely given up the uh, radio tower. They're on the opposite side. The Brits are on the opposite side over here. Uh, getting shot. So I guess Gimli has eyes Moving up. on this corner. Yeah, I'm watching. I'm gonna smoke off the east, southeast. Nobody downstairs because why would you put yourself in that sort of a corner? Lots of British on this, uh, on the adjacent uh, tree line here. And to the direct east. Grenade comes in and nails reformed alias. And I think Headbuster is just going to slowly work his way around and get another way in. More grenades from Brits coming in and causing problems. Brits are are going to be... Look like they're going to be winning. Uh, Skrevsky gets a hit here. The toe comes out. Question a miss. It actually looks like the, the Tiger got hit. And the BM, and the BTR hits a mine. Are we down? Okay. Why don't you shoot the toe? Keep firing. Where is the toe? The tiger hits a second mine and it's gone. The uh, BTR is definitely lost. This definitely lost tire on the left side. Lost wheels. Needs to be repaired. Wait, is the uh, looks like uh, commands down as well. Brits are starting to realize they've won the day. Free stalker technically not in command, so we're down to I think six Russians. One of the BTR, two move up the, rid the water line, and three here. Restock are about to get TK'd. And there goes a clean hit on the BTR. Knock it out. Whew. That seemed long. It's actually early, my guy. It's only four. It's only ten after four. To the objective. Only live once. Honu reciting the age-old uh, maxim as he gets shot at. Russia technically hold the radio tower. That's not the objective. I got one. Mission failure as far as Rush is concerned. Now they just have to survive, which they're not going to do. Although Decrum gets nailed in the so, uh, face. Covered Everybody covered there different angles. A, there was an enemy peeking at Northeast in the gap. Restalker gets a kill. I got one at least. I got one at least. Headbuster. Uh... Cover, cover, cover. Gets, uh... It's about right Where was outside he? of the fence. It's Southwest, one. right out of the side of the fence. Oh, they're behind the wall. Uh, Spartan north. Hawk is uh, dead. Shot across the uh, river. Hanu is still coming up. Toast takes a chance and comes inside and gets shot on his way in. I don't know what they're shooting at, but it exists. So, whatever. We don't question their perception. We did start early. That's going to be a thing for this month, so... All right, Hanu, uh... What was that? Was that an AP mine? Well... 
He's going to get encompassed. Well, yeah, there's another kick incoming. Steps. We're supposed to have AP mines. Freestalker almost gets naded. And King takes the uh, initiative there and uh, rolls Freestalker. Ew, Freestalker was done. No, not much you can do there. And I believe that's going to be GG. Russia not able to uh, really effectively assault the British position. Only 19 to British's 40. Gonna get a little bit of a uh, roll down here before we uh, get there. And there's the GG call from the Van Admin. Woo! And uh, that's gonna do it for us today. We're gonna take a look at... Uh...